Hey, how you doing there? Henry Olsen here from Super Simple Guitar and welcome to today's simple lesson where I'm just going to be showing you how to tune your entire guitar down a half step. This is something that's done pretty commonly in modern music. So in this lesson, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you step by step and show you exactly how to tune your entire guitar down a half step. And I'm also going to be just giving you a couple of kind of tips and reasons why you would want to do that. So right now my guitar is tuned down a half step. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tune it up really quickly and then I'm going to tune it back down with you. All right. All right. Let's do it. All right, so now I'm in standard tuning. Now, if you already know how to do this, and this is kind of yesterday's news for you, then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put up a playlist here of ACDC, so you don't have to watch this lesson, go learn some ACDC tunes. If you don't know how to do this, and you kinda of wanna learn how to do it, then just stick with me. I'm gonna do it step by step with you here now, okay? So, the reason you'd wanna tune down a half step, first of all, is because a lot of modern songs are tuned that way, right? So if you wanna play along with the original, you are going to have to tune your guitar so that when you play open chords, you are in the same harmony as the recording, right? So that's the first reason. And the second reason is because it just sounds really great. I love the sound of having the guitar tuned down a half step. And you will probably notice that once you do this, playing will just become fun and new, you know, because if you've never done it before, even if you have done it before, it, it opens up a new tonal um, just dynamic. And when you're playing your basic chords, they, they just have this nice, sweet sound to them, you know. So if you're kind of in a rut and you're bored and you don't know what to do, try tuning your guitar down a half step and you will see it really um, will unlock some new inspiration for you, okay? So without any further ado, let's check out my tuner now and I am going to tune with you so you can see exactly what notes you need to be tuning to, okay? Let's do it together. All right, so here we are, and we're going to start off with the sixth string. So I'm just going to play the sixth string. Now, normally we have an E, as you probably know, and now we're just going to go down to an E flat. Up oh, too far there. Sorry about that. So now I have an E flat for the sixth string, and I'm just taking all of the notes and going down a half step, right? I just want to walk you through it in case you don't know exactly how it looks on your tuner. So check this out now we're doing the fifth string we're taking the a we're going down to a g sharp taking the d string going down to a c sharp fourth string the g taking it down to a f sharp it's gonna sound so good now b going down to a b flat e going down to an E flat, okay? And if you don't know what a sharp is, what a flat is, if you're not sure about the musical alphabet, my free picture chord book that you can get if you just click up here explains all of that in great detail. And also if you become a member at Super Simple Guitar, I have an entire course where I talk in great depth about this, okay? So if you want to, Check that out. There's a free 30 day trial with the link under this video. Okay. So now I'm just going to retune to make sure that everything's nice and sweet, right? We always want to retune after we tune the first time. C sharp, F sharp, B flat, and then the E flat's the last one. All right, let's have a listen now. Okay, so as you can hear, it sounds great. I just love this sound. And if you're ever in a rut, playing in a different tuning like this will definitely give you some new ideas and some new creativity, right? Now, since my first recording of me talking about this, I forgot to turn on the second camera. I already said a lot of this stuff, so I'm not sure what I said and what I didn't say. 
So who knows, we'll see. Um, I might just cut into the first recording now since I don't need that camera anymore. So anyways, I hope that you liked this lesson. I know that it's a simple lesson, but trust me, you will definitely um, get a lot of benefit if you've never done this before, or even if you have done this before, you will get a lot of benefit from just trying it out, getting a new sound. It'll give you new inspiration, new ideas, and um, it's just a very valuable thing to do, okay? Okay, so I hope that this video helped you. It's a short and sweet one. If it did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out my free picture chord book and um, let me know in the comments below if you ever have tuned a half step down and if not if you just did it now how are you doing do you like the sound let me know in the comments i'd love to hear from you all right henry olson here i'll see you really soon with a new lesson see you then bye bye was i recording so i hope that i was recording because i think i wasn't i wasn't even recording Gonna have to do this again now. All right. Sorry. Thanks for checking out this lesson. Now that you're still here, don't forget to subscribe right there where my finger is. Just hit that button, click on it if you haven't so far. And over here, you can see more videos to watch. All right, thanks for watching again. Thanks for subscribing. And I will see you very soon. Bye.